When most of us become ill, we either blame our bodies or others for our plight. But Peter Fairfield says that illness is an invitation to make friends with our bodies and that there are spiritual benefits to illness. Though Peter had profound questions around the nature of reality from a very early age, his path to greater understanding of the healing process began when, by a series of serendipitous events, Peter was invited to study under the protective wing of a high-order Lama in Nepal. Well, we have to ask ourselves the basic question. What makes me feel good? What do I like? What am I drawn to? What makes me feel bad? Who in my life am I around that I don't feel good with? I mean, that's, that's the most important question. How many times do you start a talk and you say, okay, everybody get comfortable? Half the audience moves. Why weren't you comfortable before? You know, we have a right to be happy. We have a right to feel good. We have a right to have people around us that love us, support us, acknowledge us, help us to be who we are, and then we reciprocate. If we're in a life that doesn't support that, we have to ask yourself, why am I here? What am I accomplishing? Why do I have to be unhappy? Why do I have to be in pain? And the answer is you don't. And you may not be able to change it in one day or two days or a week or even a year, but by knowing you have a right to be happy, you have a right to feel good, and you can identify, I don't feel good in my work, I don't feel good in my relationship, I can change my work, I can fix my relationship, maybe my husband needs or my wife needs to heal also, or maybe we're just not the right combination together, whatever. But we have a right to start where we are. This is an eloquent view of our ability to heal our entire lives through a renewed relationship with our bodies. For the full interview, go to ConsciousMediaNetwork.com.